shout out to Dan Tedium Lover, Queen of the Ninja Turtles, for giving me this video idea. So please go subscribe to her channel and subscribe to me as well because we've both been giving each other ideas for videos and we're both awesome. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and please enjoy. Leonardo, is something wrong? Father, are you sure it's a good idea for you guys to go out and see April? I mean, I know she's up at the farmhouse to celebrate her and Donnie's honeymoon, but are you sure it's a good idea to go up there for a day and leave me and Raph here? Leonardo. You are the oldest out of all of your brothers. I am sure you will keep Raphael intact. But father, what if he gets mad? What if he gets all angry and makes me do stuff around the lair and bosses me around? If that happens, do not hesitate to call me, and I will be back as soon as I can to teach him a lesson. But you do the best you can, okay, my son? Okay, father. I will miss you, Leonardo. I will miss you too, father. And remember, it's only for one day. Your brothers and I will be back tomorrow. Okay. Did Raph already get informed about this? Yes, he did. Father, we're ready to go. Yeah, I'm ready to see my beautiful April and spend the day with her. <laughs> I know you are excited, Donatello. Is the princess going too? Yes, the princess is going as well, and so is Eva. Okay. Don't worry, Leo. We'll be back tomorrow. Yeah, dude. Good luck with Raph, okay? <laughs> I'll try to I'll try to keep him under control, Mikey. I'll try my best. Okay. Come, my sons. Let's go. See you tomorrow, Leo. See you later, princess. See you later, daddy. <laughs> See you later, Eva. Come on, Eva. Well, 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 you're home alone with me. How unfortunate can we be? <sighs> Raph, are you seriously going to start off with complaining? Shut up already, Fearless. It's already bad enough that I have to deal with, the, with everybody else. But it's bad enough to be stuck here with you. I'd rather be stuck here by myself. Raph, you know you're not old enough to be by yourself. I always have to be here whenever the guys go out. I'm well aware of that, Leonardo. Did you just call me? Yeah, I did. You got a problem with that? You know what? Since we're all alone, I'm gonna make your life so miserable. How so? You're gonna do whatever I say. You're gonna clean the room and everything. And what if I refuse? If you refuse... Ref, you wouldn't dare. Oh, I would dare. If you don't do as I say and obey me, well, let's just say that your shell is gonna go on my wall. You're talking like Shredder now. I don't care. Do you want your shell on my wall? No? Good. Then I suggest you be a good little boy and do as I command. All right. 
What is your first order, Raph? Uh, 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 that's not how you should address me. You should address me as Master Raph and kneel before me. That's just ridiculous. Shell on the wall? <sighs> Master Ref, what is your first order? Ah, that's better. My first order that you go clean up my room and clean out Chompy's litter box while you're at it. Ref, you're supposed to do that. Not anymore. It's your responsibility now. I'm gonna go get Chompy out of the room, okay? Okay. Pretend that this little twilight is Chompy. Okay, rat. Okay, Leo. I got Chompy out of the room. Now it's time for you to go clean up his filth. Fine. Meow, meow. Don't worry, little guy. Leo will clean up your litter box for you. I promise. Meow. It's okay. In Raph's room. Ten of this washcloth is cleaning supplies. Okay. Phew! Jeez! Raph's room is so dusty and messy. What is he doing here? Great. Now I gotta scoop out Chompy's litter box. Ugh, oh, it is so disgusting. Ugh. Ugh, great. Ugh. Pay you. Ugh. Well, at least it's all bad. Crap. Chompy's litter box is all clean. You can bring him back in here. Ah, I'm impressed with what you've done. Take your hand off of your nose. Well, what do you think, Master Raph? Hmm. Wow. You actually got everything done right. I'm surprised you were able to do it. Excuse me? Yeah, I said it. You cleaned up everything. You got the dust off of the bed. You even cleaned my punching bag. And look at Chompy's litter box. It looks so clean. What do you think, little guy? <laughs> That's what I thought. So am I done now, Raph? Not even close, fearless. Well then, what do you need me to do now, Master Ref? Well, I need you to go clean the living room, clean Donnie's lab, clean the training room, wash up, wash the dishes. You're literally treating me like Cinderella now, aren't you? Well, you're no princess, and you're not even close to Cinderella. <sighs> Whatever, Raph. <sighs> well, I don't want you to hang my shell up on your wall, so I guess I have no choice but to go do all of that. Yeah, so get moving! I could call the others about this. Wait a minute. Maybe I can. What are you doing? Raph, I, I wasn't calling anyone. Give me your phone. Ah, 
Yeah, so were you trying to get Splinter's help? You a daddy's boy, huh? Splinter Jr. I'm not a daddy's boy, and I'm not a Splinter Jr. Shut up. And this phone is no more, so you can't call for help. Don't even bother trying to run away, because I've activated Donnie's security system. How did you do that? If you dare question me, then I will do much more to you than hang your shell up on my wall. Now get back to work already! Guess I'm on my own now. A few minutes later, after Leo cleaned up the entire lair, man, that was a lot of work. So, you actually cleaned the lair, didn't you? Yes, Raph, I cleaned Donnie's lab, I cleaned the kitchen, the living room, our rooms, and everything. I even cleaned the training room. Aren't you even at least a tiny bit happy? I might be if you shut your mouth. <sighs> Rav, why did you do that? Because you're a disgrace. You're a fool. A fool? Yes, you foolish, disgusting leader. You don't even deserve to lead. I should be the leader, not you. You tried that once, Raph, and you didn't do a good job at it. I know, but I think this time I could do better. You don't even learn your lesson. You're just too stubborn and hot-headed to do anything. Don't you dare call me stubborn and hot-headed, you moron. Raph, what the... Shut up already. Now, I have one more chore for you to do. What's that, Raph? I've already cleaned everything. What more could you possibly want me to do? Hmm... Well, this is one thing that I want you to do. What's that? Polish all of our weapons. What? Yeah, that's right. Go into the weapons room and polish all of our spare weapons. But, Raph, no. It's either that or the shell on the wall. Which do you prefer? Okay, I'll do it. Good. Now get in there and get moving. Raph, why are you doing this? I thought we were brothers. A few hours later, after Leo polished all the weapons, What are you doing? Sleeping on the job? How pathetic. Ow. Rav. Why? You were sleeping on the job. Why would you do that? I was tired, okay? You've been making me work non-stop. You know what? Since you've done such a good job at cleaning 
everything, and I mean everything. How about I give you a reward? A reward? What are you talking about, Raph? I thought you said you wouldn't do it if I did all the chores. I know. Now come here. Well, now that he's knocked out, I can do all this stuff to him. Good riddance. <laughs> well, the others should be happy that this whole place is cleaned up for them to arrive back tomorrow morning. It's time to go get some sleep. The next morning, everybody else comes back to the lair. Wow, it looks so clean in here. Wow, it really does look all clean. Dudes. Did, did they do all of this while we were out? What's wrong, sweetie? Why is there blood on the floor? Wait, what? Oh no. Rap must have done something. How do you know that this was Rap who did it? Because... This is not his blood type. That this is Leo's blood type. Oh no. My sons, we must find Leonardo at once. I think I might be able to find him, father. You can, your majesty? Yes. I know how to use my nose. And remember, Eevees have a good sense of smell. All right, go find him. Stay with your uncles and grandfather, okay, Eva? Okay, Mommy. Guys, I found Leo. He's covered in blood on his bed. What? Leonardo! Daddy! Oh no! Don't worry guys, I'm, I'm gonna get him fixed up. I promise. This is all my fault. If only we did, if only we stayed behind and didn't go up to April's home, home. If only we didn't go up to April's farmhouse. Father, this isn't anyone's fault. I didn't know that Raph would do this. I'm scared. What if Leo doesn't make it? Please don't say that, Mikey. Leo's strong. He's a strong husband. I know he'll make it. Daddy. Daddy. It's okay, Eva. It's okay. Raphael, get in here right now. Oh, guys, I didn't realize you came back. You have a lot of explaining to do, Raph.
Raphael, do you realize what you could have done? I don't know what you're talking about, father. Ow! What was that for? You nearly killed your own brother, your own leader. How could you, my son? I thought you were better than this. All I did was ask him to be my slave. Asked or forced. Okay, I forced him to be my slave. And why would you do something so careless and reckless? I just wanted to teach him a lesson. I wanted to teach him a lesson for being a bad leader. And you think that doing that would make him learn his lesson? You should be ashamed, Raphael. As soon as your brother wakes up, you are in serious trouble. What have I done? Oh, it's you, Raph. Or should I say, the killer? Don't tell me he's dead. No, he's not dead. But he is badly injured. Is he gonna be alright, Donnie? Yes, he'll be fine. He just needs to take it easy, rest, and stay off his feet for a while. Can we see him? I don't know if that's a good idea for you to see him, Raph. He might not be happy with you. And he has every right to be mad at me. Donatello, may we go and see him? Yes, the rest of you can. But Raph, you need to stay out. Leave. <sighs> Fine. Alright, guys. Let's go in and see Leo. In Donnie's lab, oh, Leo, Daddy, my son, I am so, so sorry that this happened to you. Poor Leo. Come, everyone. We must let Leonardo rest. Father, I want to stay with him. Are you sure that is a good idea, my daughter? I want to stay, too. Yes, please let us. All right. You two may stay and watch over him. Let's go get Raph. Grounded! Ugh. Please wake up soon, Leo. Your family is worried about you. I'm worried about you. So is our daughter. Please. A few months later, Leo finally awakens. you. It's okay. I'm alright. Daddy! <laughs> hey there, princess. Daddy! Guys, you can come in. He's awake. My son. Hey, father. so worried about you. I didn't think you would ever wake up. It's all right now, Father. I'm all right. How are you feeling? I feel just fine. Are you sure about that? Yes. Leo, you're awake. 
Hey, Mikey. Donnie, are you gonna check him to see if he's okay? Yes. Come here, Leo. Well, Leo, it looks like while you were out or unconscious, it looks like all of your injuries seem to have healed themselves while you were out. How is that even possible? Well, Mikey, injuries heal a lot faster when you rest. And since Leo was out for quite a few months, his body must have been able to heal itself while he was asleep. Wow. That's amazing. Guys, where's Raph? Do you really want to see him, Leo? As much as it hurts me, yes. Oh, Raph, you big goof! Get in here! Hi, Leo. Hey, Raph. Listen. I'm sorry about what I did. Treating you like a slave and making you do all the work was not a good thing for me to do to you. So then why did you do it? Why did you choose to treat me like a slave and make me do all the work? I was just trying to teach you a lesson for being a bad leader, but now I've learned from my mistakes pretty harsh ways. Well, Raph, I understand that, but you must promise never to do that again. Families should not treat each other that way. I know. I'm really sorry, Leo. Could you ever forgive me? We're brothers, of course. Brothers to the end. Indeed. Oh, what a sweet moment. The best brother moment I've ever seen. So, are we good now? Yes, we're all good now. I'm glad. And again, I'm super sorry about what I did to you. It's okay, Raph. It's okay. Raph? Yes, your majesty? What you did to my husband was very wrong. I hope you remember not to do that ever again. Yes, your majesty. I've learned not to do that. Good. My sons... I think we should all go and rest up. We have all had a long journey. Yeah, I'm pretty tired. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go sleep. Yeah, me too. What about you, Rev? Eh, I'm probably just gonna go hang out with Chompy. <sighs> I might as well go to go and rest up for a bit too. Honey, yes, Leo. Do you mind if I sleep with you? I'm also a little bit tired. Alrighty. Come on, Eva. Let's go.